my mentor, the person I mentioned who asked me to consider writing a book and really, you know, encouraged me and helped me along the way. She, uh, when she first realized what I was doing, she said, you know, she was a big visionary person and really wanted everybody to think in visionary terms and said, so what is your vision? You know, and I said, well, I'd love it. You know, if all the the first grade teachers that we have three classes, if all the first grade teachers in my school used my systems, I would just, you know, I, I have this thing, this new mantra, you know, open hearted children lead to an open hearted world. Mm-hmm. And so it's going to be the title of this podcast. <laughs> yes, because it's obvious that that's what would happen if we could all stay open hearted, then everything we do would be like if we had an open-hearted family, let's just start there. We would have, we would sit around the dinner table being vulnerable and compassionate and communicative. And we would be able to let each other into our inner landscape. 